Okay, so you're probably wondering, um, where have been? I did watch episode 6 and 7, this is episode 8. I don't know if those are actually going to be out. Um, the footage and everything got lost. If I can find it, then yeah, I will try to find it. But that's why I have not posted those two reactions. But, um, we are reacting to episode 8 of season 3 of Amphibia. I got my hair done yesterday, that's why I didn't want to film. Because I was in pain and I did not want to be in discomfort while filming. And have enough storage. But now I got a new SD card, so it's fine. Um, we're reacting to season 3 episode 8. Hollywood pop pop and if you give a frog cookie, that's when you meet the blue guy, dude. I've seen some spoilers, but like, it's only the guy, man. So that's not really that much of a big deal. And we do see Darcy, so that's good. And the intro change, and then we get to see the hol the Christmas special for next week. So yeah, that's all I've really seen. It's not really about. I didn't watch it, but I've seen it, which is not really a spoiler, I guess. Um, but yeah. Um, let's get this reaction going. I heard we get a new intro or outro. I think this is after, um, the second part. Because we'll be seeing Darcy and stuff. Okay, yeah. Well, yeah, that's new. Wait. There. Darcy and King Andrews. And then we got mom and dad and the cat. That's new. That's all I wanted to show you. Let's get to episode. Oh, that is true. Is that the guy? Is that Elmo? Are you all actors? Guilty as charged. Still waiting for my big break, though. Humphrey Westwood. Nice to meet you. Yep. Way out of town. What, like Sacramento? Okay, are you Humphrey Westwood? Oh. No, no, no I couldn't. Nonsense. This town could be harsh on newcomers. So consider this a welcome to Hollywood from me to you. Well... If you insist. Oh, wow. Great. Uh, no, not feeling it. Such a shame, too, because everything else about you is literally perfect. Oh. <gasps> that is the most beautiful thing I've ever heard. Everyone, we've got a new catchphrase. And it looks like he didn't even cause any trouble. That's not all up. Oh, sorry. You look just like someone I know. All right, this guy got the part. Wait, I just realized I took your spot. Heck, I might have just stolen your opportunity. Ah, fish posh. It it's okay, you have that side. I have a feeling, Humphrey. <sighs> I still don't think this is a good idea, but as long as it's for something small that no one sees, maybe it'll be harmless. Everyone's gonna see, it's probably gonna be an ad to hear. Mr. 
air attack next. Hey, this is actually pretty realistic. Wait, wait. Suspicion Island's not real? Nice. Don't be so gullible, dude. <laughs> Franklin! What do y'all think you're doing? This here's a closed set. Wait, your accent isn't real? Who's gullible now, Anne? This is it, Hoppadiah. After today, you'll be the biggest frog actor who ever lived. <laughs> oh, I'm so sorry I didn't see you there. I'm free. Me? I, uh... Have an audition up there with Mitch Bravo, my friend. You should give it to him. Golly, what a break. Get up there. Mitch is waiting for you. <sighs> no, Humphrey, he is waiting for you. There he is. Got the tank part. There he is. Get him. It's not a false nose, but I don't believe this. He will get him, though. Get them on him. Abandon it. I just Maybe gave the Humphrey. Someone who's waited as long as I have. Oh, thank you. Feel power is behind the camera. With you. That's right, Anne. From now on, I want to be a director. Oh. The end. They became those ads, so I don't want that. This is called If You Give a Frog a Cookie. Okay. My nose keeps running. It's been running all day. Oh, cookies. They don't look very serious. They were for a bit, but then they weren't. So now I'm making them cookies. The answer to all of life's problems. They're good. How did you get them so crunchy? Oh, that's the cicadas. Thanks, Mommy. Do I smell cookies? <laughs> the village. Sorry, the what now? Why, our miniature recreation of Wartwood, of course. May I have this dish? Hey, oh. Dr. Jan, tell me you've got good news. Great news, actually. I've got a lead. One of my colleagues knows a string theory expert who works in the area. Back to that guy. Wow. That blue hair guy. Wait till I tell the planters. I wouldn't just yet. There are a lot of loose cannons in the scientific community. Vivia. Oh, no. I wouldn't get their hopes up because it could be wrong. Right now, Dr. Jan says... Right, Big Wally? No. Oh, who are you? Brain Simon Doc I don't know, Dr. Franks. Okay. That's cool. It kinda looks like Kosai. If you've ever been to Kosai. That's what it kinda looks like. Their voice sounds familiar. What is that? Wait, actually, we are reporters, and we were just wondering if you could answer some questions about interdimensional travel. Oh, now come with me, Terry. News. What is their voice actor? They sound very. I have to think. I said Mabel, but it's not Mabel. Oh, is that Sadie from Steven Universe? I think that is Sadie. Okay. Yep, it is Sadie from Steven Universe. That's their voice. I don't know what their voice actor name is, but yeah, that's Sadie. Because like that sounded familiar. Okay, that's when the box opened back in season one. So way like right in the beginning, like way back when the show started. So open a portal. But where did that portal go? Wait a minute. Okay, that one right there, the big one, that's the Owl House. You can just tell. I don't know what the other three are. Um, but yeah, that's the Owl House crossover episode. Maybe. I was gonna say Shira, but that wouldn't go with any Gravity Falls. Nah. But yeah, that is the Owl House. Funny, nice trick. A little Easter egg, I guess, if you've not seen that show too. Oh my god. Just a peek, but they are not allowed to be sad for the rest 
of your lives. Got it? Yeah! <laughs> All right, Dr. Freight. What is it? Oh. That could be a different world, though. Like us being a door in the window, but that would probably kill them. So, oh, that didn't work. You need like something like glass hard, like a rock. Oh, 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 cookies. Cookies really are the answer to all the life's But he got butt. What does it really matter? How much your car? What is that Terry's car? That is it. Okay, so that was my reaction to season three, episode eight of Amphibia. Hop, pop, a little Hollywood, and then the frog takes a blink. You know, what I'm talking about the cookie episode two. Oh, those are two great episodes. They're only they're one episode, but there's a part. Okay. Next week we have the Christmas episode, so I'll definitely react to that. I'm trying to get that out earlier than I usually would because it's like. It airs the day after Black Friday, which is perfect. I mean, that's like the last episode of part one of the season, and then we go into hiatus break. Which, even though I don't really like hiatus, it's kind of nice. I don't have to worry about every weekend and stuff. You no know, spoilers. And then that's probably when the Owl House will like, start putting out crap. It's like season two part B. Who knows with that? Um, yeah, um, hope you guys liked this reaction, enjoyed this, it's Sunday, not Saturday, so remember that, and it looks dark outside, because it is, it's just the time, daytime, daylight thing, it's only like 5.26pm, it's not like 7 o'clock, so yeah, happy Thanksgiving, um, my Thanksgiving break doesn't start till Wednesday, so that's gonna be fine, Tuesday, I leave early, but that doesn't really matter, it's, it, I guess it's Wednesday, but Whatever. Some people are on Thanksgiving break, so happy holidays to you. If you don't celebrate, happy Thanksgiving or anything. Merry Christmas. If you don't, happy holidays. I'll say that. But yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video, which is next week. Merry Christmas! This was a nightmare. Yeah, it kind of was. I'll get out of your hair. Hey, Amity, wait! This wasn't me. This is all Hootie's stupid idea. Yeah, this was stupid. I mean, us? Dating? <laughs> That's stupid, right? <gasps> no!